Hello Year 11, um, it's been an absolute pleasure um, getting to know you all, um, in particular my lovely lovely Year 11, who I'm going to miss so much. What do you think of Year 11? Still done? <laughs> no, 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 no. Girls are crazy and the wares are crazy. Basically all the year 11 girls, so I've just gone through a few names. We have Celery, Bieber, Wolverine, Rufus, Nicki Minaj and Barry. As you can see by the names, the classes are full of lots of fans and great cricket. Um, they're a lovely, lovely class, all the Vienna Parkway and I'm really going to miss you and um, please come back and play cricket in the summer with me. Uh, the GCC year 11 boys group, they have been absolutely fantastic and I really wish I could have sort them in year 10 and 11 because they're lovely. Uh, I think Year 11 is a great one. Sort of when I first came in here, I taught a lot of them in Year 8. I've seen them uh, grow up into quite sensible people. Um, in sometimes some of the people who've been very, very good at element, adding an element of drama have been people like um, Elliot and um, Luke and Delano, and they've made everyone laugh, and it's been brilliant uh, helping everyone learn. Yes. Now, and I suppose Mark, one of my one of my memories, it does always make me laugh when Celestia will take any excuse whatsoever to start talking about the person Stuart and the Twilight Saga, and so she thinks she's going to get away with not doing any maths, and actually it is good fun, but she's quite good about getting back to the maths. I think you're incredibly entertaining, loud, <laughs> and enjoyable group of people. From Corvina's non-stop talking to Joe's uh, amazing one-liners, um, Prince's um, amazingness, and oh gosh, all the girls are so wonderful, so good at history. Uh, this is a message to all my Year 11 music students that I've been teaching for the last two years. Um, I just wanted to say a massive well done and a massive thank you for being such a wonderful class, for being incredibly creative, incredibly funny, incredibly entertaining and just absolutely delightful kids all, all in all. Um, and I wish you really well for the future. Um, just a few memories really, just to go back down memory lane, things like Michael Wint and his stubbornness to our jockey heroes like Malcolm McLean. Best memories? Okay, good. Uh, my statistics group, which is one thing I remember. Um, Corbina and Kirsty, more or less, fighting over the chair and a seat. And you know, being quite disruptive while everyone just watched them. And eventually, of course, they would have to go out just trying to hold in the laughter on that one occasion. Um, other things I can remember is Louis with his lovely graffiti and in between doing a bit of maths work in classes. Um, I think you are a bunch of bright and um, lively and exciting students who go on to be very successful. Um, I think uh, some of the year 11s actually the most of them are very talented and have a future of and I remember going on trips, I remember little quirky things that people have said, I remember meeting everybody for the first time, um, we've, uh, myself and my group, we've done some great games together, we've had some great experiences. Um, it's been an entertaining time, as you, as you know, from Hedwig, Eden. Uh, and some bizarre conversations recently around the French horn. Um, but yeah, just a fantastic time I've had and I hope you have too. Uh, and really just a final few words of wisdom, things like all my jog the acronyms, like craft, spag, jog goggles, see the answer and so on. I'm sure you'll remember them to years to come. Um, my three favourite memories of you as year group are being your director of learning in year nine and the end of year nine prop. I think having to separate uh, Louis Duncan and Lois Howard at the time, who were doing some sort of forward dancing. Uh, my second memory of the year group would be the banter bustle with the boys, discussing football all the time. I'm going to miss those discussions. Um, I think what else will I remember? I will remember um, me winning lots of arguments against Larry. Other things again is Larry always asking majestic questions, which when he realises at all, he knows the answers to. Go on, where to start with year 11? 
Um, I've been really, really lucky this year. I've had three changes of tutor group that I've kept some of the students for the whole year. And that's meant that I've been able to get to know lots and lots of you. And of course, added to that, I've had my own year 11 class for the last two years, my own English class. Well, that's been a journey. It's been a journey where I have to say that now I think I can actually say I'm going to miss most of you. Um, yeah, I am. I'm going to miss lots and lots of you. All right, year 11, good luck for your exam. Try to be like Kubina. We spent the whole year saying you couldn't do anything in French and then aced all of his speaking exams. Oh, Vicky always catching up when she's done Latin and all the Mandarin folk always going, and who else is funny in there? <laughs> Harvey, funny, Adnan, funny. In particular, Tine, Luke, Ben M, Ben Wei Winchi, Thomas, Rao, David, Sarah, Villan, Alfie, Forehead de Monte, Anna and Kimmy, wishing you the best of luck in your history exams. I know you're going to work really, really hard and I hope you have wonderful futures ahead of you. It's another six. Yes. Memories are, well, first of all, they're very, my GCSE PE group were probably uh, my best memories. Seeing them achieve such high results in their moderation and work extremely hard throughout, two year, or throughout the, the end of year 10 and the whole of year 11. Probably my proudest moment was the moderation day and seeing them achieve all those results. I'm gonna say, yeah, my time is up at Charter now because I was only here for you guys, so there's no need for me to be here anymore. I wish you all good luck and please come back and see me if you can. <laughs> But um, I wish you all the best in the future and hope you're And I absolutely love the Berlin trip. And I'm definitely going to, to take away the feeling that we discovered a super meal model on that trip. So well done to Leon and well done to everybody else in Europe. So, how did you find teaching Year 11? Just to say, good luck year 11, some of you are going to need it, most of you won't. Not as difficult as it, as it looked like. Uh, it's a little bit of me when you get to <laughs> A level. And to all of the other year 11 historians, go for it and I hope you do really well. Hard work really does pay off. As the suffragettes <laughs> have shown us. Do well in your exams. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay, well going forward, the advice is that you know, don't think that you could have a holiday at the beginning of year 12. Good luck for the future. Um, I hope to see most of you back for, for A-levels and I will see more results then. Good luck. Uh, yeah, I'll miss you guys. I, uh, teach, I've taught most of you 11 other years, so it's been great. Um, some tips for the future is for people like Shay to pick his right options to make sure you attend all lessons and to revise and always come and visit the PE team. Um, for Arthur to stop being such a side man, Danny to stop copying Marco, Marco to be the main man. So go with it, go within your exam with positive spirit and I'm sure you'll be um, doing great in you. Oh, don't stand still for two minutes because the world is going to pass you by, so you just need to be keeping at your work. Keeping at everything that you need to be doing, you need to be doing. I'd like to say good luck to all the Year 11 geographers and everyone else in Year 11 for the future, in GC results and A-level and whatever else you want to go do. My advice would be that, you know, grades are really important, um, but that, uh, that you also have to remember to enjoy what you're doing. Um, and I know that sometimes that's difficult if there's lots of pressure. Um, finally, just lots of people who are endlessly curious and always asking loads of questions and fascinated about everything um you know who you are i'm looking forward to teaching you in the sixth form and best of luck with everything and, and look forward to sixth form hopefully we'll see you again in the charter school anyway so all the best for your results and i can't wait for you to come back to the charter school and see you in september be ready be really ready <laughs> <laughs>